Should Germany leave the European Union? This is a topic that has been widely discussed lately throughout the news and politics. Most people tend to fall on one side of the fence or the other. They believe that Germany should leave the European Union or that they should be propping up the other countries. I'm going to explain today why I believe it is necessary for Germany to leave the European Union and not for the reasons you might expect. I'm going to cover briefly a timeline of the creation and progression of the European Union over the past few years and give you my observations on why I believe it's beneficial for all parties involved for Germany to leave at this point in time. The initial European Union was formed in 1992 and is comprised of 28 countries. The monetary version of the Union, which utilizes the Euro, was established in 1999 and came into full force in 2002 with additional legislation and currently has a total of 18 countries utilizing the Euro. Over the past few years, there's been bailouts of major countries within the European Union. It consists of Ireland, Greece, Portugal, Cyprus, and the majority of Spanish banks are being propped up. The only major financial powerhouse in this equation is Germany. Now, many people fall on one side or the other, like I said. I believe it is necessary for Germany to leave. I believe that by them leaving, it's going to initially hurt all parties involved. But by doing so, it's going to allow them to grow in the long term. As it stands right now, many of the smaller countries cannot sustain themselves. They are looking at their banks completely collapsing, loans going into default, possibly causing a world financial crisis. With Germany being the only main institution, uh, this is an outside-the-box way to look at it. Uh, they've currently been talking about Greece possibly leaving the EU, uh, and Ireland as well have been discussing leaving uh, to reduce the burden of them being propped up. Some of the pros of Germany leaving, for the Germans especially, they would establish their own independent currency, and Forbes estimates that it would gain 40% in value from the euro prices currently within the first year. This would relieve the burden of supporting these failing countries due to their poor fiscal and lifestyle choices. This would allow Germany to have unprecedented growth while reducing their excess trade and allow their own economies to flourish. The main aspect that a lot of people don't realize or see from this aspect is the European Union stability. One of the main problems with uh, the smaller European Union countries that are failing at this time is their labor costs, not the value of the euro. With export values through the roof on the German side, <coughs> excuse me, their labor costs are way too high for the smaller countries. They have no way of competing with Germany. By Germany pulling out, it would initially severely devalue the euro. This would allow the smaller EU countries that remained within the EU to have reduced labor costs due to the lower value of the euro without having to do pay cuts. This will allow unemployment to go down, more people to have jobs, and will allow their economies to slowly recover. Another aspect is the fairness of it. All of the European Union countries are always talking about how this should be fair. That's one of the main reasons they have a union. They want to all look out for each other and do things fairly. At the current situation, it's not necessarily fair to the Germans. The Greeks keep coming back for more money. They get mad at Germany at the same time when they don't want to assist them. Germany has been fiscally responsible. They have a very energized workforce. They've done everything they can to assist these smaller countries. A lot of these failed countries have traditionally have very lax workforces, mandatory short days. Uh, it's very common to have mandated coffee breaks, naps in the afternoon, retirements as early as age 55, and very overinflated pensions. Uh, with this fiscal model, these countries cannot sustain this method. So in conclusion, I believe everybody in the EU benefits by Germany leaving the EU. The initial pain would not be enjoyable. Germany's export market would 
take a major tumble on the upside at the beginning. And the smaller countries would have a major drop in European, uh, excuse me, euro value. But ultimately could prevent massive bank failures and a global financial crisis. Thank you for your time today, and I hope this has been educating, and thank you for your time.